Hey everyone, this is Chanyo66, and here's another quick tip of the week. Had someone asking about uh, lithium ion packs and wanted me to cover a little bit on it, so that's what we'll do. This is a lithium ion pack that I built. It is a 6 cell, 6800 milliamp pack. Amazing pack, uh, it's right at 600 grams. When this is a 4 cell, 5000 milliamp pack, and this is 470 grams. So, you can see just in the size comparison, there's a lot more density in this. A lot more milliamps, a lot more power in this pack. The drawback is its discharge. This pack can discharge 100 amp without any issues. This pack can only discharge 24 amp. So that's where you have to run into the sensitivity of these cells. These have a massive voltage sag if you start drawing too much, where these don't have as much of an issue. The sensitivity of these is you want to have an aircraft that is extremely low power draw to be able to run these. Uh, like the aircraft that I put this in cruises around at 2 to 3 amp, so I'm well under half of the constant discharge. Because uh, when these packs get lower, their voltage sag gets extreme. Um, I have a few flights where I've actually been flying around at 8 amp, which constant on this should be right around 12. And at 8 amp, I was already seeing a 15 to 20% sag in voltage, just because of their output. They can't handle it much. Uh, these are only a 2C discharge, 4C peak discharge. Um, and on the peak, you'll see a massive uh, voltage sag. At the constant, it's not as bad as long as you watch what you're doing. Um, I try and stay way below that. That's actually why this pack is built so large, is so that I can have that 12 amp capability, but I try and stay below half of that. So I try to cruise around at 5 to 6 amp max. Uh, Multi-rotors and things, you really have to watch because these can go, these can discharge much lower than a standard lithium lithium polymer. So if you're running uh, a multi-rotor, you want to make sure your ESCs are set to NICAD or have no voltage protection on them because these can go much lower than a standard LiPo. Uh, if you try running it, any of your ESCs in a LiPo mode, it's going to shut off on you and your aircraft's going to fall out of the sky. On a plane, it's not as bad because when your battery or your motor goes out, you can glide down. Multi-rotors, not so much. So if you want to hear more about lithium ion cells, hit the comments, like, subscribe, and check back next week for another video. Chan Yo, out.